Welcome to Marcus Videocast. I am Rajesh, Analyst at Marcus. In this episode, I would like to provide you with a brief overview of our newly released research titled Kuwait ICT. Information communication technology is in constant growth in quest with economic and demographic trends of Kuwait. This induces a great need for capacity building and maintenance. In the early 80s, Kuwait adopted telecommunication technology ahead of its GCC peers by establishing NTCZ, it being the first telecommunication company in the region. Kuwait was also one of the earliest internet adapters in the region as well. However, it lagged behind other countries in recent years in terms of various key indicators. For example, in terms of network readiness index, it ranked 62 compared to 27 for Bahrain and 28 for Qatar. Similarly, it has lower mobile and internet penetration rates compared to other GCC countries. One of the key limitations of Kuwait ICT sector has been the lack of independent regulatory body, which is slowing further developments in the evolving sector. Kuwait is the third largest spender on ICT infrastructure in the GCC. ICT spending has grown at a compound annual growth rate of 12.6% between 2003 to 2011, and the annualized growth rate is expected to moderate to 6.4% over the next three years. We also expect the ICT spending to reach US dollars 28 billion by 2015. The bulk of the spending, about 80%, is towards communication, followed distantly by computer hardware and software. Based on segment analysis, we found that the spending is concentrated on consumer segment, who account for 47% of the total spending in 2011. This is closely, uh, largely followed by energy and utilities with 9.3% while the government segment contributed only 7.2% of the total ICT spending. Consumers might be leading ICT adoption in Kuwait. However, this is not the case in the government sector. This issue has been addressed by the government of Kuwait through the establishment of Central Agency for Information Technology, or better known as CAI. The CAI is in charge of digitizing government functions. The task is long and challenging, but we believe the efforts will be fruitful. As we can see the several unified communication tools including the Ministry of Health, Digital Medical Record Initiative and the TAS DED portal. CAA projects once implemented will require increased spending on the ICT infrastructure. Our report which is about 37 pages starts with the overview of ICT sector in Kuwait. The, repeat, the report discusses about the key ICT indicators the amount of spending that has happened in the sector so far, the forecasted investment levels by the segment. It then talks about the regulation and ICT adaptation by government of Kuwait. The report finally discusses about the major players, the market share and their growth drivers. The report is statistically rich and consists of 11 tables and 8 charts. If you are interested further in the report, you may please log on to our website www.e-marmor.com and can access the full details of the report. Looking forward to see you again. Till then, thanks.